Guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can add or set up an alarm on the Samsung Galaxy S21 series. So first, let's go back to your home screen by tapping on the home button at the bottom of the screen. And then swipe up to go into app screen. In here, tap on the clock application. And in the clock application at the bottom, tap on the alarm tab. At the top here, there is an add button which allow you to set up new alarm. So tap on that. And then at the top here, you can choose a time. So using the champs, uh, the time picker, choose a time that you want to set the alarm. So let's say 9 a.m. You can choose a.m. or p.m. And down here in the day selector, now you can choose a one-off day. If you tap on the calendar icon, and here it will come up with a calendar. You can pick so the alarm will go off only on a particular day. So that's just a one day selector tools. So I'm just wondering if you can select multiple days. So no, you cannot, you, you can only pick one day. And down here, you can set the alarm name. Now, if you want, you can choose from Monday to Friday instead. So let's say um, you're going to work between Monday and Friday, then you can choose the five days. Or if you work part-time, uh, you can choose maybe it's just Saturday or Sunday, just the weekend. Now give your alarm a name. So work, for example. And then we go down. Now I'm just gonna collapse the keyboard. And in here we can choose alarm sound. You can choose to turn it on or off. If you tap on the left-hand side panel, you can choose the sound. And here you got Bixby Alarm. You got Spotify. So wake up with your favorite song, or you can choose a ringtone. In here, you can go down the list and select a ringtone that you would like to use. Now this is a custom song that I have added to my notification folder. You can also tap on the add button at the top. And in the list here, you can, in the sound picker, you could choose your own songs. This is quite a large list. So you can go down the list and select your own songs. You can also tap on the search button to search for the name of the song. So I'm going to go back here and I'm just going to select a song from the ringtone list. And then in here, you can choose read time and alarm name out loud. So you can turn that one on and then tap on back key. Okay, now that we're back here, you can turn on or turn off vibration. You can choose the type of vibration it is, the pattern of the vibration. Next is the snooze option. You can turn on or turn off snooze. By default, it has an interval of five minutes and a repeat of three times. You can set the interval to five, 10, 15, or 30 minutes with a repeat of three times five times or forever. And that's it. And now we're gonna tap on the back key and then tap on save. Now that we have saved the new alarm, it will automatically turn on by default. So let's say if you have a holiday break, you can always go back into your alarm and turn it off without deleting the alarm. And when your holiday period is over, you can go back into your alarm and switch it on. And that's it. And if um, there's any alarm that you no longer need, like this one here, you can always touch and hold onto that and then tap on the delete button and that will be removed from your list of alarms. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.